So the rock I have in my hand in this moment is a very, very special rock. This is called Kimberlite. Why this rock is special? Okay, so it's a little bit strange because it contains a lot of strange minerals. But when we break this rock, then as a magic, we get a very special mineral. And this mineral is called diamond. This is exactly the topic of our study. We study diamonds. Actually, we study inclusions in diamonds. Why? Because diamonds give us important features, important information about the deep earth. So sometimes, from these strange rocks, not only we get diamonds, but we get very special diamonds. We got accepted just now a paper in Nature because we study blue diamonds. And blue diamonds are, for example, maybe you remember the Hop diamond, the Blue Farnese diamond, and the Cullinan Dream diamond. Actually, exactly the Cullinan Dream diamond, which was sold in uh, March 2018 at $25 million, was one of the diamonds that we study in this paper that we published in Nature. Why diamonds are blue? The answer is very simple. The reason is the boron, the element boron. Maybe you heard about this element. It's quite a rare element, actually, but it's very important. Boron is, is at the base of many uh, plants' lives, and in geology, it's extremely important because it's at the base of many pro processes, geological processes, like the formation of the Earth crust. So, what we have discovered, actually? We have discovered that uh, this blue diamond contains a lot of minerals which are defined as a super deep. What, what this means? Super deep diamonds and super deep inclusions means that we can crystallize these materials at very, very, very deep regions in our planets, 600, 700 kilometers depth. This, kilometer, this depth is not absolutely possible to get in any other way. You must only study diamonds. And why this discovery is very important? Because actually you must remember that in diamonds we, of course, have carbon, which diamond is made up by carbon. The main impurity in diamond is nitrogen. We have oxygen in diamond. Actually, main inclusions in diamonds are silicates, and silicates are based on oxygen. Moreover, we found in 2014 that some mineral inclusions in these diamonds have water, so we have also hydrogen. And finally, we discovered boron. So all these uh, five, six elements that I mentioned are extremely important for life. And what is extremely intriguing and fascinating is that these elements travel with, in the space with diamonds from very deep regions to the Earth surface, and also they can really give us important information about the evolution of our planet. Because don't forget, diamond can be old up to 3.6 billion years. So this means that uh, we can really have a picture of history, of the evolution of our planet, and especially studying the most important elements for life and for our planet Earth.